men ran to the rescue of a woman trying to hang herself on a Clearwater bridge. The scary life or death moment played out during rush hour yesterday evening. News Channel 8's Jamel Lene joins us now live from the Bayside Bridge at McMullen Booth Road and Gulf to Bay Boulevard where this woman dangled over the edge, Jamel. Yeah, very scary. You know, she was right over here, uh, right over the westbound lanes at the top. And with, again, seconds to spare, a noose around her neck. These two men held on for dear life. Justin Ludwiszewski was driving north on Bayside Bridge when... I noticed that there was a woman who was seemed to be on, sitting on the side of the bridge there along the concrete barrier. Ludwiszewski felt something wasn't right. She seemed a little agitated. You know, I wasn't sure, again, what was happening, if her truck was just broken down and she was upset or what. Um, then I noticed that she had a cord, and I just had a sinking feeling in my gut that this, you know, she was potentially trying to hang herself. With seconds to spare, he quickly stopped his car and ran over. I saw, you know, the noose around her neck. Um, I saw that it was tied to her truck, and... Um, so when she went, I was able to grab onto her arm and just kind of use the concrete bear as a lever to, to keep her from going all the way over. Clayton Lopez was driving by. When I looked over there, I noticed two bodies, and I noticed one body wasn't there anymore. That's when he heard Lou Wyshevsky scream. First initial guy who really was helping at first uh, was screaming for help. Lopez ran over just in time. I was just scared to death that I wasn't going to be able to hold on, and I'd have to watch, you know, this woman you know, fall and die. They both pull her back over the ledge to safety. I just hope that, you know, she's okay and, uh, you know, she gets the help that she needs and you know, she's able to enjoy the rest of her life. And Jim, both men tell me that this had to be one of the scariest moments in their life, but they were glad to be at the right place at the right time. What an incredible story. What about the woman? Do we know how she's doing? Well, we know that she was taken away and rushed to a nearby hospital, but we are checking with authorities to find out how her care is going. And once we find out, we'll be sure to pass that information along as well. Jen. All right. Jamel Lene, live for us in Clearwater. Jamel, thanks.